Hello from my name is Yellow and welcome to week 6 of TWF Red. So, we are back and in this episode we have some interesting matches. We're starting things off here with Ricochet, the new member of TWF Red, taking on Kalisto. Then we have a non-title match between Pentagon Jr., the number one contender for the Intercontinental Championship, taking on the champion Kenny Omega. Following that, we have Grado taking on Goldberg, which... Uh, Quite the interesting matchup indeed. Following that, we have a triple threat match between the three TWF Red members who qualified for the Money in the Bank briefcase, which is Shinsuke Nakamura, Riza Ramon, and King Cuerno. And then the main event, we have Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose teaming up again to take on Bray Wyatt and his mystery tag team partner. So. That is the show for this episode. Hope you enjoyed. If you do, please like it up, subscribe down below if you haven't already. And other than that, I will see you all next time. There may be no stopping him. He's in big trouble. Oh, out of nowhere. Well, Kalisto really made a name for himself, competing in his hometown of Mexico City prior to going to NXT in 2013. Look at this, right to the body. Thank you for kicking off your weekend with us. We've got a great Friday night plan for you tonight. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. Yep, there's the reversal by Kalisto. Oh, well, this spells trouble right here. Oh, Shade, there it is. It's so hard not to be impressed by Shade here tonight. The Kings earlier going for the cover. One, two. Kick out. Uh, the kick out's all that saved him. This match goes on. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. More. They love it up there. Oh, they're taking a risk here. That's how you win matches. Oh, Shade, there it is. It's so hard not to be impressed by Shade here tonight. Two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle. One on one, mano a mano. Today, too fast. Just making his presence felt there. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. He's really taking over this match now. Well, look, a win tonight is huge. I mean, just think about this. The title's not on the line, but the momentum you're riding after a win like that is huge. Well, luckily, the body hasn't absorbed too much of an attack up to this point. Shoulders. Plenty of fight left. You're right. This guy's still near 100%. Elbow smash. Quick thinking to avoid that. Not going to win many matches with that move. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Uh-oh. What a slam. Oh. This entire building just moved. Man, you're right. That shook the arena. Not today. Too fast. He's simply reminding him 
that he's here. God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He's showing no signs of letting up. Here we go. This could be it. That's it. He's done. this Friday night is anything like last Friday. We're in for a, quite a treat tonight. Extreme Rules is such a dangerous night. Anytime you throw the rule book out the window, somebody is bound to get seriously hurt. Thank you for kicking off your weekend with us. We've got a great Friday night plan for you tonight. Oh, out of nowhere! Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole. What's he going to do here? We're looking at complete domination here. to potential injury there. There's no quit in these guys, but unfortunately only one of them can be victorious here tonight. This has been a great matchup. You're right about that, Cole. A Matt Classic. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. When he gets going like this, there are few better. Oh! Oh, and he got dropped. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back, and I love it. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. Not this! Incredible! This has to be it! up this pace. This could turn real ugly real fast. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. He's really done a number on him thanks to moves like that. He's got the shoulders down, Cole. This could be it. And a kick out. And that's all that matters. This match continues. You know, it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. Oh! Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expand. End of story. This one's over. 
This might be it. Two. Three. He did it. What a huge win. And there's the bell. This match has started. This is a classic. Two guys battling it out one on one. Remember, only the strong survive. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempted offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. I wonder what Post is thinking at this point of the match. Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken too much punishment up to this point. These competitors will always be looking to unleash their finishing maneuver, and when that happens, the complexion of the match can change in a heartbeat. You're right about that. The entire match can end in a heartbeat if somebody hits their big move. You have to assume that tonight is one of the favorite nights of the year for the referees, right? I mean, there's practically no rules to enforce. The only thing they have to worry about is declaring a winner. Uh-oh, what are we gonna see here? What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? Not today, too fast. The range of emotions here is startling. There's almost an unknowing of what to expect. I know. I, I mean, I got goosebumps. This match is going to be so unpredictable. I just can't wait. Where did this explosion of offense come from? Oh, out of nowhere. I don't want to know what that feels like. Yeah, well, I've felt it before, and you're right, you don't want to know. Quick thinking to avoid that. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Hey, so effective. Got him hooked. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, looking to make a statement here. Uh oh, there's the elbow drop. The elbow drop has hit again. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Kelt, Kelt, Kelt. match now. He's got him. It's an amazing atmosphere in this arena tonight. Oh, well, you're right. Big fight feel here, no doubt. Makes the cup. One. Not going to win many matches with that move. Oh, Post got it. Post delivers big time, Cole. Hoping to end it early. Here's hoping. One, two. He's making a statement here with this attack.
Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Seems like these guys are letting out a lot of pent-up frustration tonight. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars that WWE have to offer. He's in full-on attack mode now. There's going to be a lot of offense in this match. You wouldn't have it any other way. That's what I love to see. Oh, that headlock's on tight. Nicely done. Big. Oh, an amazing move by Ghoul Cole. Quick pin attempt here. We're seeing two outs. Post got it. Post delivers big time, Cole. Covers. One, two, three. What a tremendous victory. This could be absolutely violent as these three competitors go to war. What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? Can't stay vertical after the belly-to-belly -belly suplex. One of the best moves ever to take your opponent off his feet. Oh, out of nowhere! Why is the guy his opponent and what's he going for here? There's the clothesline. Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Oh, out of nowhere! A ferocious clothesline! Just devastating! The back is the largest area on the human body, and thus always a target. I know what you mean. You know, I've got a week back. How long did you have that? Well, about a week back. When it strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. The human body can only absorb so much of that. If the action this Friday night is anything like last Friday, we're in for a, quite a treat tonight. Oh, out of nowhere! You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Yeah, you really have to enjoy hurting someone. Uh-oh. If his back wasn't hurt before, it certainly is now. Yeah, and it's going to be hurting for a while. Honey, oh, missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. This is dangerous. Oh, a huge slam. The shoulders are down. Showing no signs of letting up. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs. Oh, oh, Ramon, there it is. Man, that could be the difference maker for Ramon. Boy, he just got laid out. 
My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. That's it. He's out. Much more of that. And he's not going to last long. He's got him hooked. Uh-oh. Climbing the turnbuckle. An early pin attempt. Come on, Rip. Count. Adding insult to potential injury there. Look out. Uh-oh. He looks absolutely unstoppable here. I have a feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over. Watch it. Watch it. Oh! Remember, momentum in WWE can turn on a dime. And leave you some change. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Oh, out of nowhere! We might be seeing the... There's the super kick! Man, and it was right on the button. Look at a catch of... And the referee's count is interrupted there. Well, it just goes to show you that an attack can come from anywhere when you're in that ring. slow getting back to his base here. No, oh, wait, nice reversal. Just making his presence felt there. Well, oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you could find yourself in a world of hurt. Nice move. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Today, too fast. We may have discovered his favorite move. You think? He seems to use it often enough. Inside the ring again. Yeah, and they should be. This is where the action needs to be. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, out of nowhere. Oh, this isn't good. That's it. He's done. What a finish. Can he score the pin? And he breaks the three count. Oh, I got to tell you, I really thought that could have been it. Quick thinking to avoid that. He's got to be vigilant about not taking any more damage to the neck. Razor's edge. Ooh, that was sharp. Oh, they're he can end it here. But now, two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. And there's the bell. In a tag match, it's important to remember that it's not about how good the individuals are, but how well the teams work together. That's the only way to win this thing. Don't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. Yeah, none expected and none will be shown. And Rollins with the reversal. Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken too much punishment up to this point. Quick thinking to avoid that. There's the switch. Look at this. He's in full control of this one. Not today. Too fast. And Rollins with the reversal. 
And there's the tag. Just making his presence felt there. He's in big trouble. Look at this. Bray Wyatt doing some good work here. I'm not sure if I've ever experienced an eerie silence that falls over an entire arena like I do when Bray Wyatt announces he's here. Even in darkness, you can see the whites of people's eyes and the audience fixated on Bray Wyatt and frightened beyond explanation at what he's going to do. Bray Wyatt on the offensive? The back of his head is taking an incredible beating. Yeah, and that's a sensitive spot. that can't handle much abuse. One of these guys is going to walk away with the win here tonight. I just can't imagine one of them also accepting defeat. Quick thinking to avoid that. Dropped! And that was a hard, hard shot. You know, I've been in a lot of arenas, and I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen a capacity crowd stand with such a combination of fear and awe as when Bray Wyatt begins his ominous walk to the ring. Look out. That's what happens when you're in a powerful grasp. You go down. Oh, that slam was vicious. He's got him hooked. Cole, what's he got in mind? Okay, just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. Heads up. Sometime. Yeah, that was a costly misstep. I think you can tell by looking into the disturbing eyes of Bray Wyatt that he likes this. This man enjoys knowing that when he walks into an arena, people are frightened of him more with each horrifying step he takes. But that doesn't tell you what you need. The shoulders are down! And he escapes with a kick out. I don't think Bray Wyatt knows how to quit. He's making a statement here with this attack. And now he's back out on the apron. Dean Ambrose is not someone to sleep on. Watching the superstars file into the arena earlier today, you could tell that they have a just a different mindset. I mean, they know the dangers that go along with competing in extreme rules. In the mid-2000s, Dean Ambrose became known on the independent wrestling circuit for taking and dishing out ungodly amounts of punishment. To fans around the world, Ambrose emerged in 2012 as the eccentric leader of the Hounds of Justice, known as the Shield. Oh, Ambrose emerged as the leader of the Shield, all right. Women and now Bray Wyatt could have this match in the bag. Going for the cover. If the action this Friday night is anything like last Friday, we're in for a, quite a treat tonight. Oh, out of nowhere! Not today, too fast. While viscerating WWE's most revered figures, Dean Ambrose became the 77th individual to hold the prestigious United States Championship, a prize that dates back to 1975 in the NWA, when WWE Hall of Famer Harley Race defeated Johnny Weaver to become the first champion. Sister Abigail. You're right. Nobody gets up from that. It's 